It was 1879 when Spanish landowner Marcelino Sanduzatuola was searching for prehistoric artifacts on the floor of a cave called Sueva de Altamira on his family property in northern Spain. Suddenly, his eight-year-old daughter Maria called out, Look, Papa, oxen! Marcelino looked up at the cave ceiling and saw paintings of bison, almost fully life-sized, that appeared to be tumbling across the sky. Despite 14,000 years passing, the paintings were still vivid yet delicate. Since then, ancient cave paintings walked into modern society. Thousands of similar paintings have been discovered in more than 200 caves scattered throughout southwestern France and northeastern Spain on either side of the Pyrenees. Now, have a close look at some of them. Simple, right? Yet no painter alive now could do better. Imagine the ancient humankind standing on wooden scaffolding using red pigment collection from iron oxides and black from manganese to paint. Due to the lack of pigments, they had to use different techniques like spraying, block printing, carving, charcoal drawing, as well as hand painting to compensate. Why do you think prehistoric people painted animals on cave walls? Just for decoration? That doesn't seem likely because the caves were so dark. We think they painted animals for hunting references, letting people know better about their prey. At the same time, the carvings were also a part of some kind of ritual to pray for fruitful hunting. We can't be sure those animals were painted so long ago, and the real reason may forever remain a mystery. But take a look at some paintings. Did you find out? Prehistoric people have already begun to tell stories with images, just like us today. But at that time, neither language nor writing were invented yet. What an epoch-making art. Do you like it? Good night.